Hey, what's going on, y'all? It's Omega from the Evans Family Gaming. And before we get into today's video, I want to bring something up. Um, I just got done watching Lieutenant Lieutenant Lightbeard's video going over some stuff that is saying that Snow Games is in a lot of trouble. Um, I don't want to really speak on this a whole lot because I don't really know about the whole how corporations have to report their earnings and their loans and all this. But supposedly, they're asking Nitrido the server hosting for money the the nitrido is the main server the main server provider for arc survival evolved for official and unofficial and snell games is asking them for money i'll put his uh, video in the description below if y'all want to go check that out and we can have a comment or leave a comment and let me know what y'all think about it or whenever we stream next we can talk about it um we're going to be streaming some arc here pretty soon um and also some diablo so y'all can come in and jump in the diablo stream and we'll talk about what's going on with that i'm going to do some more research on it myself that's the first time i've ever heard on heard about it but yeah that's definitely something that is uh piqued my interest and i'm going to find out more information for next week's video um i'm going to educate myself on the matter so that way i'll be able to speak on it in more depth also before we get into the video i want to give a little announcement that um whenever asa comes out we will be giving away two free copies to subscribers um you're gonna have to be publicly subscribed and if we hit 550 subscribers before the launch of asa or the launch of season two for diablo 4 we will be giving away four copies of asa and giving away four copies of the season pass for season two of diablo 4 and so for those of you that don't know how to do it so you're going to go to youtube you're going to click on your little profile you're going to go down to settings and then you're going to go down to privacy and it says keep all my subscriptions private you're going to click that off if you want to be eligible for the giveaways and then you're going to leave it like that that way i will be able to see who is subscribed to the channel um and so will stream labs and it'll make doing the giveaway a lot easier all right and with that out of the way let's get into the very first segment of this video it's where we go over to snow games twitter and i'll show you all everything that i've been fighting against with what i've been saying and using the hashtags uh, free wild card, I added a new one, which is um, which is let wild card go, and as well use and also using unban the island boys. So the uh, first tweet is from about six hours ago. Upon recording this video, it says uh, it's a canon event. I said it's never canon with snow games. It's always cheats, exploits, unjustly banning players, and they bully for hashtag free wall card into not being able to say or do anything to save the hashtag art from being destroyed. Hashtag unban the island boys. Um, we'll cover this here in just a moment. Um, we got be careful. Uh, they said uh, the adventure is heating up in Pixar. I said, be careful, because when the heat shows up, they start rolling back servers, spawning in godly BPs, duping, and unjustly banning players better than you. GTFOH with your BS. Hashtag free wall card. Unban the island boys. Um, battle ferocious creatures and rival tribes as you strive to survive the... Are you brave enough to face the dangers and conquer the Ark? The Ark. Seriously, what's the point when you would just roll these servers back, dupe, exploit, and ban players better than you? Free wall card, unban the island boys. So I believe, oh yeah, so they're, they're, they Snow Game started tagging um, other content creators that are, um, and, and acting like they're part of them or they're associated with them and in reality, and most ten, nine times out of ten, they're not even associated with Snow Games um i said it's a trap they will ban you the second you get better than them free wild card unban the island boys um i do believe this is the one that i started using yeah hashtag let wild card go so going here on out every single response that i give snow games will be saying uh hashtag free wild card hashtag let wild card go and hashtag unban the island boys um, but they asked, how do you feel about the game crossovers in general? I'm good. I didn't vote that. So I don't know why it's lit up blue. Maybe it's just showing the, uh, the winner or whatever. <clears throat> but I said, I feel like you double crossed the art community by not addressing the issue at hand. You are a cheating, exploiting, and untrustworthy publisher that cannot be trusted to police your own PVP cluster. Y'all need to free wild card, let wild card go and unban the island boys. 
but that's the uh that's the most recent tweets that i've been fighting on um like i said this is an everyday thing i try to get there as soon as they post but sometimes i might be a day or two late or a couple hours late but for the most part i do go in there every single tweet that they that they send out and contradict anything and everything that they say because they have just unjustifiably um cheated and exploited and banning players that's not that's not okay and they've remained silent on it for months already for actually technically years since they did all that stuff on official servers way back in the day um but with that segment over let's get into today's uh, or yesterday's community crunch so before we get into the actual crunch i do want to address uh free drake um, he informed me uh, last week's video that um, the actual shutdown of official servers will be in September. I did go into July 1st Community Crunch where they actually did announce the new official closing date. It says right here, is there going to be a change to the date when ARC Survival Ascendance official network comes offline? We are now planning on shutting down the official network on September 30th, given the slight delay in the launch of the game. So I appreciate you uh, for pointing that out. Um, so I went back and I found the exact date. That way I can correct a mistake from last week's video. Um, also, a couple other things I want to touch on before we actually get into the today's crunch. Uh, the last mention of um, arcs, the ARC animated series was back in the Community, Cun Community Crunch 355, which was on March 31st um and it read right here it says art the animated series has completed the animation and cast recordings of all its 14 initial episodes which are currently in post-production vfx sound mix etc we are delighted with how the show has turned out it is an epic melodramatic love letter to dinosaurs fantasy sci-fi and of course arc itself though we have not placed it yet with any platform hence the lack of news in that area so as soon as there are more to report as soon as there's more to report, we will let you know. That was back on March 31st. Here we are, August 12th. Like, why have we not had a single mention of it? If there has been elsewhere, let me know and I will correct it again. But as far as I know, there has not been a single mention of the animated series since then. Like, zero. They've been dead silent about it. Which actually brings me back to the beginning of the video where I talked about Lieutenant Lightbeard's video where he's going into that Snow Games does not have the money to finish Ark Survival Ascended. I think if that's true to it, like I said, I'm going to do some research, get into it. I think it's because they spent so money, so much money on these big name actors for an animated series that was supposed to come back, come out probably sometime a long time ago. <laughs> you know, like they, they hired all these actors to do this work back whenever COVID was a thing. They, they probably didn't think it was going to, not saying it's not a thing anymore, but back whenever lockdowns were real big and, you know, the whole world shut down basically and they probably thought that it was going to be like that for a long time and that kind of backfired on them and so now they're just kind of stuck spending all these millions of dollars that they can't even finish their current game now or even say anything else about the animated series because they don't have the money and they're having to borrow from nitrido allegedly that to finish arc survival ascended all right today's community crunch 374 the center creature submissions evo event and more says welcome to another edition of the community crunch if you've ever wanted to see your favorite creature added to arc now's your chance there's only a few days left to submit an idea for the center on arc survival ascended take a look and upvote your favorite creature submission from the community before the top 10 vote takes place on monday august 14th so that's in, in two days two days we have two days before we actually start voting i'll put the link in the description for that so that way you'll be able to come back to the video and go put in your votes. Uh, community creature submissions. Let's take, a, let's take a trip down memory lane as we embark on our journey to the center for the next community creature contest. What will be the fan, the fan voted real world creature that will launch with the map for Ark Survival Ascended? Please note this creature will be released for the center. So make sure your real world submissions are in theme with the map. We covered that last week um the entry period will end 1 p.m pacific on august 14th the voting will begin immediately after and end on august 21st at 1 p.m pacific the winner will be announced in the crunch on august 25th 
Make sure to check our Twitter on August 14th for the ranked vote link. And I will also be putting their Twitter link in the description below as well. And this is nothing new. It seems like every single weekend since they announced Ark Survival Ascended, there's been an Evo event. I personally do not understand why they're even doing Evo events. Just pop an Evo event and let it ride, dude. Y'all have literally a month and a half left to enjoy Ark Survival Ascended arc survival evolved so just let it ride with the higher rates and just let it let it be mayhem on the pvp servers let the pveers just enjoy the higher breeding the higher harvesting and you know i don't know a whole lot about the pve scene but whatever the pveers do awesome let them enjoy it with the higher rates um arc apocalypse i did not realize it wiped today or or yesterday or i would have been jumping on i wanted to play this wipe i'm hoping we get one more wipe in uh, that would be awesome. Arc Pock is my favorite, and I'm really hoping that they have an Arc Apocalypse uh, server whenever ASA releases because that would be freaking awesome. Um, I know my wife and daughter, they really enjoy the PvE aspect of the game. I'm more of a PvP person myself. Um, they do, they have delved in a lot of PvP, um, but you know, they like to be able to do the slower, sit back, enjoy the game, the breeding, you know, so. Hopefully they have Arc Pock whenever ASA releases. That would be awesome. Um, oh, also the beginner servers, you know, that's fun. I might jump on that here in a few days and jump, just kind of mess around. Those are fun. It's uh, just a bunch of 1X, you know, everybody's jumping on. It's meant for new players, but let's be honest, most people that jump on the beginner servers are not new players. Um, so then we go into the community corner. Um, you got a couple of videos here. I've never heard of um, Jim Bob, um, but congratulations for making the, the crunch. Um, TBF Gaming featuring Tyru Hunter, um, some fan art. We got, um, oh, that's a nice Megalo. I like that. Uh, Ice Wyvern, that's a pretty sweet um, end game picture, more than likely, probably, maybe uh what is that oh just a chip that's a chibi okay and then we got welcome to art but yeah man i mean this is the these crunches are getting so dry like i don't understand why they're so stale why they're so stagnant um i do know dolly came out and she said um right here uh, to be honest, the responses to what we were showing were mixed. So we were like, mm, this is taking extra work and the community isn't super into most of it. Let's chill on that for a while and just have everyone work on ASA. And that was going, that was pertaining to the concept art that they were giving us every week or every other week. If you haven't noticed, we haven't had it in a couple of weeks. Um, I think that's a not a very smart move on their end for the sole purpose of at least we were seeing something. Yeah, it's that little bitty nothingness is better than nothing. Um, it gives us some kind of false hope that it's going to be releasing on time, which actually Jeremy came out in discord and said, I don't have the screenshot. I've seen it somewhere else and actually said that they will be releasing arcs of Bible ascended on time. So we'll have to wait and see how that pans out. Like I said, we got about roughly six weeks before it comes out. So I'm really hoping that something happens between now and then, and they actually show us some in-game screenshots, in-game um, videos, record or something. Give us something, you know, besides these. I mean, they're awesome. Don't get me wrong. These, these, these creature votes on maps that we're not even going to see until next year. You know, I think it's crazy that, that they're doing all these votes back to back to back to back to back. And we have yet to even see anything promising as far as what we're going to be getting in October. So, yeah, y'all let me know in the comments if y'all think it's going to release in October. Um, I, I don't think it will be. I would really like it to be coming out in October. I just don't think it will be. I really think it's going to be the beginning of the year, especially with what, you know, allegedly Snell Games borrowing money from Nitrido. That is that is crazy. Um, I'll be looking into that tomorrow. Um, I'm going to see what I can find out on that topic, and I will be covering it in next week's video. So with that said, I appreciate y'all watching the video. Um, like I said, we're going to be doing a giveaway at 550 subscribers. So if y'all don't mind hitting that like button, subscribe to the channel with the notification bell on. 
and i thank y'all for coming and watching the video and watching the streams that we've been doing so i hope y'all stay safe this week and i will see you on the next one